Hi, it's Nat Hoy from Red Fox Property Group and today I'm at 5 Charles Street in Maylands. The top three things I love about this home. Number one would be this stunning facade, circa 1905. Doesn't get a lot better than that. Number two would be the original character features. The two front rooms are astounding. Wait till you see them. And number three, of course, Maylands has to be location. Probably not for the reason that you think though. It is everything, well, partly to do with this, the gorgeous Charles Street Reserve, which is directly across the road. What a gorgeous outlook. Let's go and have a look around. Before we head inside, there's a few things I wanna show you outside. First of which is that you've got parking, you've got a hard stand here on the verge, and you've also got gates and off street parking there as well. And let's have a look, I know, down that fantastic reserve. We'll come through because the outdoor area on this is out the front. It is just beautiful and it's set. What's great is obviously you've got the park across the road, so no neighbors directly opposite and the house itself is set a fair way back. So really the most pleasant place to enjoy the beautiful Northern sunlight is here out the front. So there's a fantastic deck area that was put in by the previous owners. It is just gorgeous sitting out here on the eve in the evening, drinking your cocktails, watching the sunset. Doesn't get much better than that. Said this beautiful facade and I'll come back around and you can see the size of this glorious front garden. There's also this beautiful Jarra decked veranda as well. And that's another view of the lovely sitting area, which just shows you how pretty that aspect is out to the park. We'll pop inside. We're here in the formal entry hall, and I wanna show you these beautiful Jarra boards, tall skirts, amazing architraves, picture rails, and of course, high ornate ceilings. We'll come around and we'll start with the formal living space. This is a magnificent room. The proportions in here are wonderful. And in fact, it's so large, you could comfortably separate it into two rooms if you needed to. It is fabulous. Have a look at the floor plans online and check out those dimensions. So we've got two beautiful tall sash windows here. You can see two seater couch. We've got a two and a half seater couch there. Split system aircon on the wall. And then we come back and you've got this fabulous fireplace. And indeed, if I come around, you can see we've got the telly tucked behind there. And then we've got console here as well. It is such a magnificent and beautifully proportioned room. I'm going to cut across the hallway into the main bedroom. And again, this is another huge space. We've got a queen size bed, we've got bed sides, and you can see how much extra space there is. And look, if I pan down, you can see all the extra floor area, the beautiful tall ceilings, and all of this wonderful built in storage. We'll come down towards the back of the home. We've got the open plan kitchen dining. We've got a bathroom tucked away there at the back as well. That's all renovated. I want to show you first though bed two. This is such a cozy, welcoming room. Great light through here. You've got the fireplace, which is now um, blocked off to create a bit of a feature. You've got plenty of room for shelving and you've got plenty of room behind the door here for a robe if you need one. I'll just pop into the corner and give you another view of the room. Great space. Here we are in the dining. Back in the dining, we've got a six seater table there. Fits very comfortably, lots of good room around it. There's the old fireplace there. We've got shelving either side. I really like that, it's super cute. And then we've got the renovated bathroom. So bath, shower, vanity with stone bench top, good underbench storage, and loo. We'll come through to the kitchen. 
again another just light bright welcoming space oven microwave recess overhead cupboards range hood gas cooktop double sink dishwasher you've got everything you need here and then some it's just a nice tidy space fridge recess pantry and extra cupboards and yes you can spot a third bedroom we've only advertised this as a two better online we wanted to put a bed in here so that we could show you the proportions of the room so it's a double bed bed size either side rug still lots of extra floor space make a fabulous home office or hobby room or set it up however you choose let's pop out the back so we're out the back of the property and this is what I would refer to as really your utility space. It's just a very practical extra area for the laundry and other stuff. So the laundry's through this one, there's storage here and there's storage behind me as well. You have very conveniently a ramp, which I really like rather than stairs. You can see the laundry room, it's pretty original. It's got the fabulous double concrete sink plenty of room for a washing machine and plenty of room for extra cupboards and storage. It's just really what it is. It's super tidy. You've got the artificial turf. You've got fence line. There is a gate here and that leads out to the side access, which goes to the rear property. And you've got extra storage sheds in here as well off the back of the home so just a really handy extra space but of course your entertaining area is that hero deck out the front last but not least let's talk location you've got the reserve opposite and 100 meters up the road you'll strike guildford road with its buses to the city and also on guildford road about 300 meters away you've got pizza amore mio and the garden cafe on guildford both very popular with locals for the train you're 800 meters from nelson station and you're 850 meters walk from the start of the Maylands Social Precinct. You've got Coles, hopefully soon a Woolies, and a plethora of other local cafes, restaurants, and amenities. What is not to love? Call me now, 0405 812 273 for more details, or we'll see you at a home open. Have a great day.